Let's talk about Jose Abreu at first base tonight. He's my top infielder. You know, it hasn't been a great second half for Jose Abreu. This is somebody who 18 games through that span is only hitting 190. But here's the beauty about Jose Abreu. Even though he's only hitting 190 and has only 12 hits in the second half, uh, seven of them have gone for extra bases. So at least when he's actually dropping the ball in for a hit, they're usually going for extra bases. He has a 303 isolated power against lefties, and that's beautiful because tonight he's going to be facing Daniel Lynch, who has just been an absolute gas can on the mound. 6.95 ERA uh, with a 4.12 FIP. Uh, doesn't strike out many guys. His command can be lackluster. So I think this is just a great spot for Jose Abreu, who looks like he's kind of sort of maybe getting out of that slump. It's starting to come around. So I'm going to take Jose Abreu in this spot. Don't think the ownership is going to be too crazy high on him tonight because of how uh, lackluster he's been at the plate. But I think Jose Abreu is starting to turn it around and you can't pass up that power he has against lefties. Darian, as you look at infielder, I also want you to have it in the back of your mind. And I know Bukes has already given himself the one nothing advantage, but you you can yes. agree. You guys can agree. Oh. So that first one, if, if you want to be on the same page and just call that a wash, you are allowed hey. to do that. Hey, where's, hey, where's the coffin. fun there? Where's, where's well, the fun? I, I didn't say it's fun. I'm just saying you're allowed to do it. Yeah, Coffin, you're, I mean, you're never on this show. Like, don't come in here and start calling your shot, okay? You I'm not this, calling like, my just... shot. These are the rules. Again, I consulted okay. with the people in the truck. This is the situation. For People as much as my identity as a human is tied to me winning this segment, I mean, God, guys, I want it so bad. Um, <laughs> let's let's talk about some other players to help people out. Uh, if I have to pick an infielder, I feel less bad about this because I took Toussaint, but let's just go with Vladdy. $6,200 <laughs> is only $600 more than Jose Abreu. Right on right situation tonight against Tristan McKenzie. He has a 198 WRC plus when hitting off of right-handed pitching so far this season. And McKenzie... Good strikeout arm, but he doesn't really know where the ball is going. And that tends to leave a lot of grooved pitches. And that's why he's given up 2.76 home runs per nine to right-handed batters so far this season. If I can take Vladdy, I'm just going to take Vladdy. Got to try to score that point any way I can. 